Coming up next, a UFC Bantamweight Jump. Let's get this one started here. Round one is underway. And we've got a striker who is a force to be reckoned with. Tonight, though, he draws a guy who can do a little bit of everything. And that guy is usually the one that will have the advantage. But we know what a high-level striker is. And this guy is as high-level as we've ever seen in the UFC. Oh, big punch lands. Yeah, he's mixing it all up. Well, that body kick was there earlier, not there on that attempt. Big body kick land. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the time. Big ball punch land. Now he gets back to range. And he landed the right hand there. All right, so he lands another jab now, just snapping that thing off. I believe that the jab was lost in mixed martial arts initially. But now it has been found, and it's been found by this young man in this octagon tonight. Just missed with the left there. Well, it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Sean O'Malley. Both fighters exchange in the pocket. Oh, I'm not sure his opponent knows where he is. No, he is on Keith Street right now. He's seeing Creed Bird over the top of his head. If you take a look like that, you are on wobbly legs. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. O'Malley gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. Right hand upstairs. O'Malley's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. All right, so he continues to land that patented jab and keeping his opponent at bay. You can know that it's coming, but until you're in there with him, the speed and the power of that jab is something you can't really prepare for. Big kick lands. And just inches away from landing one of those big right hands. Oh, now that we see, he is officially rocked. A big, massive hook that really has put his opponent on skates. Thirty seconds now to go in round one. Oh, and now he's hurt. That's one of those shots that if you take one of them, if you end the night, that one is right on the spot. Well, both fighters pretty comfortable on the ground, DC, but you got to be very careful hanging out here for too long if you're his opponent. All right, so let us now check out some of the action in that round, DC. There was a whole lot of it, including a stunner upstairs that nearly closed the street. All right, all right, calm down. Oh, 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 oh. Second round underway. Still nice body kick lands. All right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of... Yeah, on that punch right there. His opponent's compromised, DC. It's one thing to land a hard shot. It's another thing completely to land a perfect shot. And that was a perfect shot. Blocks the shot. Oh, big knee. Oh, straight right. Oh, dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. And just misses with that big right hand. Big punch man over the top. How's he gonna follow this? That was a thudding leg kick. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Oh, 
Well, he's really starting to land a high number of strikes here in the second round. No denying that. Oh! Beautiful leg kick for him. Good stick. Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Back to the feet. Big knee to the body. His strike attempt there is blocked. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut oh. This might be the biggest shot of this entire fight. He lands a massive kick to put his opponent on wobbly legs. Any body kick may finish this fight. It does not have to be the front one up the middle. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Oh! Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Punches block. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Pretty good job by him there to raise the guard and block the strike. Keeping those hands up to protect that cut in and around the eye. Oh, nice jab there. He told us on Thursday he wanted to break this dude's nose. That is certainly a step in the right direction. Mission accomplished. Uh, you are battering that nose. That jab is fast. Look at that jab. Right on the button. Oh, well, that'll quiet the storm shot blocked by O'Malley. All right, so there's the end of the round. He stayed committed to doing damage upstairs. Last round, guys. You ready? You ready? Third round underway. Job here blocking these shots. The chin is tucked, the hands are high. Pretty good job defensively thus far. Great job defensively. He's seeing everything coming. Whoa! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got to very bad. Back to the feet. Well, just as he did the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here. And he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Now he's on top of him looking for a finish. All right, he's trying to control posture here. Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. All right, side control now. O'Malley gets back up. No surprise there. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Man, he is so sound defensively. Nice job to raise the guard there. It's the relaxation that allows him to see things coming and block most of the strikes that are coming at him. Oh, swept the leg beautifully to get the takedown. Mr. Miyagi will be very, very proud of that sweep. Great job getting into your position and finding that beautiful takedown. Bottom fight.
fighter trying to control posture, unable to do so. And now he's in a lot of danger. He's got to grab that head or he's going to get blasted. What a fight! All right, so as we await the judges' scorecards, DC will look back at his handiwork. He had it all going from a striking standpoint tonight. Man, he did a great job. It was very entertaining. The official decision is in. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for decision. All three judges score the contest. 29-28. For the winner, by unanimous decision, Sugar Shaw! Yes, so All right, so the judges are in agreement tonight. He is your winner by unanimous decision. Certainly pretty easy fight to score, I thought. Yeah, I thought it was an easy fight to score. Whereas his opponent had a few moments, he was the one that truly did 